Welcome out to Inside the Ropes. My name is Scott Beatty. I'm the two-time Emmy Award winner and the sole host of this show. Ryan Young has disappeared. Some say he's on assignment. Some people say he's in the trunk of my car. The second one is unsubstantiated. And GQ, I'm talking to you. Now, I'm here to prove that anybody can co-host this show. Proof. Why? Come here. You. Crabby! This is... This is a power referee. I don't even I know his name. name. All right, what is your name? Jason. Is that your real name? Yeah. Okay, Jason, watch this. Uh, match we uh, gonna just took a, we're gonna take a look at in a minute here is the typical teacher versus student. Dazzling Donnie against Scott Spade. What's your opinion on this match? What? Scott Spade is going to whip Dazzling Donnie. And right? Did, did that happen? Better than Ryan Young, everyone. Inside the ropes, and once again, just another segment to show that anybody can co-host the show who's not named Ryan Young. I'm Jason. What do you What do you do around here anyway? I'm a referee. Uh, that would explain the shirt. Uh, anyway, here's a match that's coming up at Fox Lake. We're here tonight uh, between Mikey Wild and Tyler Sunday for the regional television title, and uh, that dipwit Tyler Sunday. Uh, this I I. Ugh. Okay. Are you gonna are you gonna see that match? I am. I'm gonna be refereeing that match. You you gonna be refereeing that match? I need to go referee that match. I think I'll send him a couple of bucks by PayPal. Tyler Sunday kicked out on the two count. Mikey Wild needs to concentrate on his man, not on the referee. Tyler Sunday now fighting for the outside of the ring. Is this one a very early match of your candidate? Oh, definitely. Most of Tyler Sunday's matches have been match of the year caliber as far as I'm concerned. Well, yeah, except for the fact that he wins most of them. You can't argue with success. But look at Mikey Wild coming back with a bolo punch. guys realize, oh, if he's a nightmare driver off the top, tell me, no. Oh, I would be so no, excited. No, no, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, this has got to be it, RJ. Please, 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 please. One, two, three. Yes, yes. RJ, RJ, he won. He won. Inside the ropes. Now, I have a special segment for you, a special treat for you, the audience. This wasn't scheduled to be on this show, but tonight in Fox Lake, we have a new regional television champion. I couldn't be happier. I am giddy. This is giddy. His name is Mikey Wilde. He's the American Nightmare. He just devastated Tyler Sonny, that dip. And you know what? I'm going to bring him in. This is big time. This is big time. The new television champion. This is Mikey Wilde. Look at Kat. Wow. Mr. Scott. You can see can that, I, ladies can I, and gentlemen? Can, I touch, can, I touch? can you touch it? Just, just. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, right? That's beautiful. We shine her up real nice because she's staying here for a long time. Mm -hmm. Tyler, I told you, you're in my world now and you can't ever leave. If you thought for a second you were going to take me out, it doesn't matter how many chances you get, I will always prevail. Yeah, you may have held the title for quite some time, beating everybody up and down the roster, but you got to remember who's the best goddamn wrestler in this company. And I'm going to prove it right here, because this is going nowhere. Scott, you want to pull that out real quick? Yeah, yeah. See, American Nightmare and the Monster Squad are here to stay. 
And although your mom may like your may not like your cream sickles, I know she likes my cream pies, so I got stuff to do. Entertainment returns to VFW Post 703 in Fox Lake, Illinois for more wrestling action on May 2nd. Already set to appear, Powell Reginals collide as Chris Cairo faces Eric Freedom. Mitch Blake and Screwball take the fight to Joe and Tom Heisman, the gridiron grapplers, and the Beer City Bruisers defend their POW tag team titles against Out of Control with more matches on the way. Don't wait to get your tickets online and save $5 off the door price by going to www www.powentertainment.com There's only a two count, I don't know what you're talking about. got a few words to say. Vinny World won the riot title? Yeah, exactly. Okay. Exactly. Oh, hey, GQ. What, what happened, man? You okay? You're loving this song. I, I'm just, you know what? I'm not taking personal uh, glory in this, but uh, I kind of am at the same time. Yeah. I bet you are. I bet Vinny's taking personal glory. I bet Chaz is taking personal glory. I bet Pee Wee's taking personal glory. I wonder why I mentioned all three of those guys. Because it took all three of them to beat me. It was a chain. Jason, why don't you sit down? Or, well, that means even, you thank you. See, in Fox Lake, yeah, Vinny, you beat me tonight. I can sit there and say the same thing. Yeah, Chaz, you beat me tonight. Hey, Pee Wee, you beat me tonight. Scott Spade, you beat me tonight. That makes you a world champion, Vinny? To bring an army with you to be one guy that makes you a world champion? I never had to go to that level of Vinny to be champion. My talent proves it. Walk around with your title, Vinny. Walk around with your world title kicks. Guess what? I don't give a shit about the world championship anymore. Please. What do you mean, oh please? I'm not, I didn't say anything. I don't care anymore about the world title. Because I don't need it to prove that I am the best in POW, in Chicago, in the Indies, in the world, anywhere I go. I am the best! GQ is such a soul loser. Take a good look. This is the belt of the POW World Heavyweight Champion. I am referring to the hardest working man in professional wrestling, a man who told all the naysayers, the doubters, and the haters to kiss his ass. The first world champion ever to grace the Moretti Agency. I am speaking about toxic Vinny Riot. As such, this Moretti Minute is dedicated to putting this belt 
around its rightful owner's waist, celebrating as only we can do, and judging by the clock on the wall behind this goof behind the camera, your Moretti Minute is up. Goodbye. As I promised, an interview with the new POW heavyweight champion. You notice Tyler Sunday's not here, he's my co-host earlier in the show. We already dumped him off. Why? Because we have a world champion in our midst and the Moretti Agency, as usual, has delivered. Gentlemen, please come in here. <laughs> oh my, oh my. Ladies and gentlemen, let me That's properly funny. introduce you to... Mm. Stop. Let me properly introduce you to the POW World Heavyweight Champion, Toxic Vinny Riot. Tell him, champ. I've been to hell and back with you, GQ. I've been to war with you, GQ. You are the best of the best in the sport of professional wrestling. And all it took tonight was one, two, three. For those three seconds, I was the better man. And to coin the phrase, whether you like it or you don't like it, you better learn to live with it because this belt is around toxic Vinnie Riot's waist and around that waist it will stay. The new POW heavyweight champion right there and as I was going to say for three seconds he became the better man and now he is the better man for all time. Thank you! Thank you Vinny! Thank you Chaz!